Hello guys, good morning, all of you. How are you today in this beginning of the, I mean the final week? Then I'm gonna give you two more minutes and then I'm gonna wait for the rest of the students. And then after that, I'll be with you in less than two minutes, all right? So in less than two minutes, I'll be with you. I forgot to tell you something, guys. Remember, we're gonna use the student's book then go and get it please all right go and get your students book and in less than two minutes i'm gonna be with you all right so hurry up go and get it Okay, hello guys, good morning all of you. How are you today in this Tuesday of the final week? How are you today guys? I hope you're you're getting a, um, a good day. Yeah, and I hope you are getting all your classes on time because remember that this is the final lap, okay? So guys, in this beginning of the, of the class, I'm gonna explain you how it's going to be the way to work in this, um, in this final week. Yeah, in my subject, okay? I'm gonna talk about myself, which is an English subject, okay? I'm not gonna talk about the rest of the subjects because the teachers have the different style, different way to finish this course, all right? So um, I wanna tell you in, in some minutes, yeah? I wanna tell you how it's going to be the way to finish this final week, all right? Meanwhile, I'm gonna check who is, in the class, so I'm gonna check the list, all right? We have only 29 viewers, which is not the right amount that I really want to, but anyways, we're gonna start, okay? So I'm gonna say hello to all of you, which is Santiago Miranda, you were the first one. Hello, good morning, man. Over here, Marco, hello, good morning, Mark Flores. Then over here, we have Ignacio Montelongo, hello, good morning, man. Then JP Amaro, good morning, man. Metzli. Good morning, lady. Ashanti Segura. Ashanti, hello, good morning. Oh, sorry, it's Ashanti Segura. Hello, good morning, lady. Then over here we have Jano Aguilera. Good morning, man. Benjamin, very good. Good morning, lady. Then we have Lilian Carrillo. Good morning, lady. Valer Angel, good morning. Michelle, good morning, lady. Then we have over here Ellie. Ellie, good morning, lady. And then Eric Sanchez, hello, good morning. Then we have Leo Velis, hello, good morning. Then Patty, hello, good morning. Then Emily, good morning, ladies. Over here we have Natalia, Ivania, hello, good morning, all of you guys, you too. Natalia and Ivania Chires, good morning. Then we have Alina, Alina Garcia, hello, good morning. We have Sophie, good morning. And Jimena Hernandez Ornelas, good morning, lady. 
Dennis, hello, good morning, lady. And then we have over here Emilio Delgado, good morning. Mia Aguilar, good morning over here. Then we have Victoria, hello. Welcome to the class. Then July, welcome to the class. Then you have a nice picture, which is about the Joker. Very good, nice. Then present over here, very good. Then we have Daniel Martinez, good morning. Mark Courier, hello, good morning. Jorli, what a miracle, hello, good morning. Then over here, I have Caroline, hello, good morning. Then Paloma, Paloma Padilla, hello, good morning. Camila Alvarado, hello. Then Alejandra Guzman, hello, good morning. Ivan Zamora, good morning. We have Alex Cosileon, hello. Lopez Cosileon, hello, good morning. Stacy and Mariana Sandoval, good morning, ladies, all of you. All right, so guys, I was telling you that I want to explain you how it's going to be, how it's going to be the way to work in this final week, final lab, final whatever you want to call it. I have something here, look, it's my hair, it's from this side. Oh, yeah, it's here. All right, so guys, the way to work in this final final uh, week with me is gonna be this way. I want you to pay attention because I'm, I won't repeat it, okay? I won't repeat it, so please pay attention. Then we have Alexis, hello Robert and Miranda. Hello, good morning all of you. Guys, uh, the stuff that I want you to do in this final week is this. Today, as you can see in my slide, today we're gonna work in the student's book. Guys, believe it or not, I've been like um, searching, I've been like trying to get the best information from the books because, uh, which is obvious, we're not gonna finish the, the books, yeah. And today I took one of the pages, it's not the next one from, from the order we have. I, I took another, another page, yeah. Because I considered, I consider myself and yourself, um, this page has the best one, yeah? The best one to finish with the books, all right? Then, Lilian, give me a second, give me a second. I can show you the, they don't even know what is going to be the, the picture, okay? They don't know what is going to be the, the, the number of the page, okay? I'm gonna send you the, the, the picture, don't worry. Okay, so we have JC over here and Suli. Try to be on time, guys, okay? Please. All right, so today we're gonna work in the student's book. Yeah, remember that it's very important to have your participation, so when I ask for volunteers, I want you to participate, yeah? If you're a student who never participates and then you are just here, Mm, you said press and you said I'm here, but yeah, where is your participation? Okay, so that's what is very important for you to to be a volunteer when I ask for. Okay, so today I was telling you that I took one of the best pages that I that I saw in the book. Yeah, so because we're not gonna finish with the books, unfortunately, guys, you are the well, you are not. Well, yeah, you are part of of this generation you are going to be part of the generation of the COVID-19. <laughs> yeah, that's the stuff that, I, that I'm gonna call you. Yeah, because um, this is the first time that I do this, all right? And then you're going to be marked, you're going to be marked in, in, in my career as an English teacher with the name of the generation of the COVID-19. Yeah, unfortunately, where well, you're in second grade, but anyways, you're gonna be part of it. Yeah, it's worse than people from third grade, right? Because they are like, they really are, yeah? The, um, the generation from the COVID because they didn't have the party, they didn't have the prom, they didn't have the, the graduation, they didn't, they didn't uh, say goodbye teacher, they didn't say anything, all right? So they really are the generation of the COVID-19, right? Which is a virus, okay? Well, uh, over here we have the stuff, but before we start, before we start with with the lesson in the book, I want you to participate. I need three volunteers to share with us what you did on the last weekend. Three volunteers. You have to send me, 
you have to send me the, um, the voice note with all the information, with all the information you have, um, you have done in this weekend, okay? Who is this person? Okay, I don't know you, so I'm gonna block you, all right? So sorry. Goodbye. Berta Flores, who is Berta Flores? I mean, I don't know. Okay, so well, over here we have Emilio Delgado, the first one, Jano and Suli, very good. And you too, Alex, okay? You too, Alex, very good, nice. So you're gonna send me, what? Oh, sorry, sorry, I block it because this is not my, my own. Okay, so Emilio, Jano, Suli and Alex, send me a voice note to the group of WhatsApp with all the information you did in the weekend, in the last weekend. Hurry up, please, guys. This is gonna be the way the way to participate for you, right? So send me a voice note to the group of WhatsApp with the information you did in the last weekend, okay? So two minutes, hurry up for you four. Hurry up, guys. I'm here now. All right, the first one, I have it. The first person is Emilio. Very good, let me check it. All right, very good. Thank you, Emilio Delgado. Nice. So you were playing video games in your Nintendo Switch, and then you were doing homework, and then you were helping your father to, to paint your house, which is good. Nice. Very good. Now I have another person who is Jano Aguilera. Hello. Um, um, I, I saw the TV, um, I see the, all the saga of Indiana Jones. Um, Good. Uh, yeah. All right. So technically, Hano, you didn't do anything, right? You just watched, um, Indiana Jones, um, yeah, saga. Yeah, the season of the Indiana Jones, which is good, but you didn't do anything. What about homework? What about uh, if you stay at home, you, you should do something. Like, for example, Emilio said that he helped his father, like painting the house. Uh, he was playing video games. He was doing homework, which is something that you didn't do. But yeah, anyways, thanks for sharing. Now, Emilio and Hanno, you have your participation with me. So now what is that? You have a check in my list, right? So next one, next one, Axel, you are 15 minutes late. Okay, Axel, just to let you know. Then we are missing, who was the other one? Suli, Suli and Alex, Suli and Alex. I need your voice note to the group of WhatsApp, hurry up. Suli and Alex, I am waiting for your for your participation. You were a volunteer. If not, I'm gonna change this volunteer, okay? Well, then please do me a favor. Okay, so we have the uh, one from Suli. Let me listen to it. I think I the numbers. I do so much project. And I so much homework. And two, I see movies. I clean my room and the house with my family too. And the last, I play volleyball and, and soccer ball with my father and mother. All right, it's football or soccer, right? That's it. Okay, thank you, Suli. You were doing a lot of things, too much homework. Very good, nice. Then you were um, helping in your house, cleaning everything, which is good. Thank you, Suli, thanks for sharing. Then we're gonna go for the last one, which is gonna be 
Alex. I um, just did homework, researched how to make an electric radio without batteries and was completing homework. All right, so you were doing homework the whole weekend, okay? Thank you, Alex, for sharing. Thanks all of you to pay attention here. Thanks uh, for everything, yeah, just to say something. Well, guys, uh, for the people that are already arriving, it's, which is Axel and Nicole, yeah, I just want you to pay attention in, in the information that I already said, all right? The information that I already said is the, the way we're gonna work, okay? Is the way we're gonna work in this final week and then go back and check the information. Or if you don't want to go back and check the information, you can ask your classmates, right? Well, perfect. Now we have 36 students. What is this? It's nothing. Well, yeah, you're something, but it's nothing comparing to the whole students, to the whole amount of students. Anyways, so later on you're gonna say, teacher, why, why did I fail, teacher? Why am I failing? Oh, come on. It's obvious, it's logical. Yeah. All right, so over here, let's begin. Okay, so guys, the pages that I want you to use today are this one, 78. Open up your student's book in 78 and 79, please. Pages 78 and 79, please, from your student's book. Hurry up. Pages 78 and 79. Hurry up, guys, from your student's book. This is the page. Pay attention. This is the page about the body. Yeah, that is the page. Okay? Hurry up. Are you guys ready to start? Just tell me yes or no. Are you in page 78, guys? Open up your student's book in page 78. Yep. Are you guys ready? Okay, so the first information, the first thing that I want you to do is says, number one, put the names of the body parts in the right place, okay? Put the names of the body parts in the right place. What is this? Well, I want to explain you. What you have to do, guys, in page 78, these body parts, these body parts, I want you to put them in this body, all right? They are 12, all right? So could you please put the right body part in the right uh, place, please? I'm going to give you for this activity two minutes, okay? No, well, it's, 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 it's nothing, two minutes. Four minutes for this activity, guys. You have to put, yeah, thank you, I know. You have to, you have to put the body part in the right place, okay? They are 12. That is the first activity that I want you to do right now. I'm gonna give you four minutes, hurry up. And the uh, start, I mean, the beginning is now, hurry up. I want you to put the right body part in the right place, okay? So hurry up. I'm gonna say it again, pay attention. Guys, from this list over here, this list, which is they are body parts, they are 12, I want you to put them here, okay? I want you to put them in this body, all right? All of you, so please hurry up. Four minutes for this activity, guys. Hurry up. Don't send me a picture right now. At the end, you're gonna you're gonna listen to me and how is gonna be the way to send me your jobs, okay? Not now. Lilian, I'm gonna send you the um, the picture just in case you don't have it. There you go, you have now the picture in the group, Lillian. Now the picture is in the group, Lillian, you can check it there. Three minutes. All right, Ellie, you're so fast. Elizabeth, Elizabeth, you're so fast. Very good, nice, I want you to work like this. Very good. 
Nice. So now let's wait, Ellie. All righty, mighty. Very good. Two more minutes. When you finish, just try to, I mean, let me know, like Ellie did it. Yeah. Try to, to write down or um, I'm finished or something like that. Okay. All right. Paloma, very good. You're the second one. Congratulations. Then we have, no, you're not the second one. Alina, very good. Then Camilo Alvarado, Benjamin. That picture is in, is in, in, in the group of WhatsApp, Benjamin. So Emilio, very good. Alina, Paloma, and Caroline, very good. All of you, perfect. You're working so fast. No, Fernanda, you don't have to send it to me. You have to send it to me at the end with all the activities that I'm going to leave you right now, okay? Not now, please. All right? So, well, thank you, all of you. Thank you, Caroline. Thank you, Valeria Rangel. Thank you, Eric. Thank you, the rest of the people, okay? So now, activity number two, very good, the rest ones. Hano, Fernanda, very good, then Leo and JP, good. Then, second activity, write in your notebook, pay attention to this activity, guys, okay? Write in your notebook where can we wear the items in exercise 1C. What, teacher? I wanna explain. Guys, in exercise um, 1C, which is this one over here, this is the exercise that I want you to pay attention. All these items or clothes, in this case, you are going to write in your notebook where do we wear, where do we use them or wear it, okay? Which is the same, okay? For example, it says number one we have, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you all the, the items we have there. We have the hat. We have the gloves, we have the ring, we have the glasses, we have the shoes, we have the belt, we have the scarf, socks, and pad, all right? You're going to tell me where can we use these items, all right? You have to tell me, teacher, well, I'm going to help you with the first one. The hat is going to be in the knee. What? No. The hat is going to be here. Exactly, Mariana. Yeah, exactly. So in your notebook, you have to write, for example, hat. And then you have to use uh, the body part. Like we, you, we wear the hat in the head. And then next one, it says gloves. We use the gloves in blah, blah, blah. Next one, we use the ring, blah, blah, blah. All right, so hurry up. I'm gonna give you for this activities in your notebook, all right? So I'm gonna give you, I'm gonna give you for this activity other four minutes, okay? Other four minutes. It's in your notebook. Hurry up, guys. Other four minutes. What is the question, Mariana? Yeah, it's, it's the stuff. In which part do we wear it? Okay. Hurry up. Four minutes. Yeah, it's in the notebook, please, Nicole. Hurry up. Yes, Lillian. But I recommend you to do it right now, please, okay? Because you have a lot of things to do with all the, the subjects. If I'm giving, giving you time to finish right now, Lillian, you can do it right now, okay? Hurry up, please, Lillian. Four minutes. Yes, Mariana. Pad, Eric, what is pad? Uh, you can use shoulder pads, you can use um, knee pads. They are protections, okay? They are protections, Eric. They are protections. Shoulder pads, elbow pads, knee pads, head pad, which is a helmet, okay? Hurry up. Three minutes. No, Roberto, you don't have to send anything. You have to send it to me at the end of the class, please, Robert.
Okay, so guys, I need, yes, Stacy, you are here, don't worry. Scarf, Robert, the scarf is something you use here. When it's, uh, when it's winter, you use a scarf like this, here, okay? It's not a tie, it's not a tie, it's a scarf, you put it here. The one la like Leo, Leo loves, all right, I need a volunteer, guys, to send me a voice note with all the items answered. All the items, like for example, the hat we use it in the head, the gloves we use it in the blah, blah, blah. Yeah, with a voice note, I need a volunteer, different volunteer, yeah? If you want to get your, your participation, hurry up. Just one person, the first person who says me is gonna be that volunteer. Okay, you have to you have to send me the voice note with the with the answer. Okay, with an answer. Who is going to be that volunteer? Okay, Car ah, the first one was Eric. All right, Eric, hurry up, man. So Eric, I'm gonna wait for you. Then when you finish, we can uh, go on to the next activity. Right? I'm gonna give you time. Yeah, send me the voice note to the group of WhatsApp. Thanks, Ale. Thanks, Caroline. Well. I have the volunteer, okay? So Eric, hurry up, send it to me to the group of WhatsApp, please. And in this way, you're gonna get your participation. All right, Eric, very good. I didn't check it. So sorry. I was doing another stuff. Okay, so Eric, let me check yours. Thank you, Eric. Very good. And elbows, right? Very good, thank you, Eric. You have now your participation with me, Eric, so that means that you have a check, a nice check. All right, guys, next activity, if you can see this information, it says, listen to the teacher and answer the questions in exercise two, all right? So what is all this activity? I'm gonna be like, like the recorder, I'm gonna read the information and then you're gonna answer the questions. It says, how much do you know about the body? Yeah? How much do you know about your body, all right? Then I'm gonna read the information, then you're gonna answer all these ones. It is like, um, it is like ABC, all right? So you have the answers there, you just have to circle or underline the right answer, okay? It is very easy. I'm gonna try to read it kind of slow because I won't repeat it, okay? I'm gonna read it just once and then I'm gonna do it kind of slow and then, um, yeah, I'm gonna read it slow and then please answer all these quiz. They are only eight questions, all these quiz, okay? They're gonna be only eight questions, guys. They are eight questions, so please answer the questions with the information that I'm gonna read, okay? I'm gonna read an information which is, uh, is, is very good, okay? So please, are you guys ready to answer? <clears throat> if you are ready, I can start reading. Just let me know. Yes, teacher, I'm ready. We can start. Ready? Are you guys ready? Where is it, where is it? Oh, it's here. 
Yeah, ready to answer the quiz? I'm gonna read the information. Ready? <coughs> <coughs> Ready, guys? Yes or no? Are you guys ready for this activity? So now I can start reading. All right, all of you answer correct. Ready, 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 okay. Guys, answer, I mean, take the best answer, I mean, the right answer, because I'm gonna say the answer, just pay attention to me, okay? <clears throat> Sorry, I have, I have a sore throat here. All right, it says, pay attention, I'm gonna read kind of slow, okay? It says, good afternoon. Today, I'm talking to Dr. Lacey Roberts. Hello. Dr. Lacey is going to answer uh, your emails about today's topic, the human body. Are you ready, Lacey? Of course. Okay, let's begin. Rosa in Sydney writes, which is the longest organ in the human body? Which is the longest organ in the human body? The skin is by far the largest organ. It covers around two square kilometers and weighs around five kilograms, all right? So that is the first answer, guys, pay attention. Then next one, it says, um, wow. Okay, so Rosa also asked again, which is heavier? The liver or the brain? Now pay attention, this is the answer. The liver, it weighs around one and a half kilograms. The brain weighs only slightly less, about 1.3 kilograms, right? So that is the second answer. The next one, okay, next question. This is one from Clive in Melbourne. Which nails grows the fastest? Okay, the question is, which nails, which nail, grows the fastest? Good question. In fact, the fastest growing nail is on your middle finger. Fingernails also grow much faster than toenails, around four times faster, okay? So that was the next answer. I didn't know that. Now, Pat from Perth asks, where are insects bites the most common? Where are insects, insect bites the most common? on the hand and the arm too, if it exposed, all right? So that is the other answer, okay? So next question says, Tara from Queenstone asks, how many liters of blood are there in the human body? Well, it depends how big you are, but generally around five liters, that is the other answer. All right, next question, it says, uh, Larissa in Darwin, which is the least useful part of the body? Which is the least part of the body? It says, in fact, Larissa, there are a few body parts that are, aren't essential, but such as the tone, such as the tone seal and the gallbladder. You know what is the gallbladder, guys? It's a part we have, like, uh, we used to, to pee, right? The gut bladder, then, but I guess the least, the least useful part of the body would be the appendix, okay? The least useful part of the body would be the appendix. The appendix has no function at all, okay? And the last question for today, Melanie from Canberra asks, if it's true that the brain is more active at night, yeah? Yes, it is. Researchers has shown that the brain stores more information in the evening, which is at the night, all right? Then, okay, thank you, Andrea. We'll back after some messages from our sponsors. Don't go away. All right, so that was the information, okay? That was the information, that was very clear, okay? That was very clear, then, if you have the answers, I'm gonna take, this time is going to be part of volunteers, guys. I'm gonna take, a, I mean, not eight, I'm gonna take four volunteers. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take four volunteers to tell me the answers on this page, okay? All right, the first volunteer, the first volunteer, 
Why why what? Why what? Uh number 4. It says no. I I told you. No, I told you. Listen to me. I'm going to read it again. Come on, guys. Pay attention. It says, it says over here, and I said it, uh, which is heavier, the brain, blah, blah, blah. Okay, it says, next question. This one from Clive in Melbourne, okay? Which nail grows the fastest? Pay attention. Good question. In fact, the fastest growing nail is on your middle finger. Fingernails also grow much faster then toenails around around four times faster okay pay attention okay thank you ellie now you said it no emily i didn't i didn't jump it i didn't skip it i said it it was two two per one <laughs> yeah it was a discount two per one okay thank you natalia very good you too all right so well guys i want to take the four people volunteers then robert thank you Robert, you're going to tell me with a voice note <clears throat> the answer of the number one and number two. Okay, Robert? You are the number one and number two. Then Natalia Moctezuma, you're going to be three and four, Natalia. Okay? Natalia Moctezuma, two, I mean three and four. Then the next person is Caroline. Caroline, you are going to tell me the number five and the number six, Caroline. Okay, Caroline, number five and number six, Caroline. And number seven and number eight, Marco Flores. Hurry up. With a voice note, all right? Robert, one and two. Natalia, three and four. Caroline, five and six. And Marco Flores, seven and eight. Hurry up. You have to send me the voice note to the group of WhatsApp. And in this one, you're going to get your participation in this class. Hurry up, guys. Very good. We're about to finish. Oh, JC, uh, Jimena Hernandez Ornella, so sorry. Too late. Too late. Hurry up. So, Robert, Natalia, Robert, Natalia, Marco, and Caroline. Hurry up. I have the first one. The most useful part of the body, the appendix. Hey, when does the brain store more information? At night. Very good. Thank you, Marco. Natalia? Yeah, and the other question, Natalia? Oh, I have it. <clears throat> I have it. Thank you. Very good. Uh, now, <clears throat> what happened? Okay, now we have Marco. The appendix, good. When does the brain store more information? At night. Exactly. So Marcos information, Marcos information says that the appendix is the least useful uh, part of the of the body, which is correct. And Marco is saying that the um, the brain stores more information at night. Very good. Thank you, Marco. Then the answer from Natalia, the first one, is uh, the fin the middle finger, okay? And then the other answer from Natalia is? What? Exactly. Like fingernails, fingernails grow much faster than toenails, right? That is your answer from, um, from Natalia. Then Caroline. The hand. How many millimeters of you have? Around five. All right. Then about the insects is in the hand. That is the right answer. And about the liters in, in our body, I mean liters of blood in our body is around five. Okay, nice Caroline. You have your participation. Now Robert. All right, very good. Which is the largest organ? The skin. And then which is heavier, the liver or the brain? Obviously the liver, okay? Very good, nice participation, guys. I really like the way you are participating, very good. 
Okay, now turn the page. Well, you don't have to turn it. Pay attention to page 79, guys. I need a volunteer to read. To read all the information about the brain. All this information. I need one volunteer to read all this information. One volunteer. We're going to skip the first part because they are comparatives and superlatives. We already uh, learned this information in the classes at the school, all right? So we're going to go to this paragraph where the brain is, okay? We're going to read this information. I need one volunteer to read, to read the whole paragraph. I need a person who can read kind of fast. So no, no volunteers, so I have to take the volunteer. Eric, you already participated. Thank you, you have your participation. Give the chance to another person, then the second person is Camila Alvarado, okay. Camila, you're gonna read, do me a favor, all the paragraph about the, the brain, please, okay? Hurry up, I'm gonna give you all. You're free, you have time, okay? So read the information about the brain, please, Camila. Hurry up. I'm gonna wait for you. Now guys, meanwhile, the rest of the students, could you please answer the questions in exercise B? The rest of the students, could you please, we're gonna, um, we're gonna wait, don't worry, Camila, I wanna wait for you. I wanna wait for you, Camila. You have to read the information that this paragraph, okay, Camila? The rest of the students, could you please answer by yourself? It is not mandatory to read this information to know. This is for you. Could you please answer these questions in your in the, in the book? Yeah, this this quiz is for you. All right, the rest of the students, please hurry up. Camila, I'm waiting for your voice note. Hurry up, Camila. <clears throat> Hurry up, Camila. Camila. Camila Alvarado. Yeah, sounds weird. Like Camila Cabello. Cabello. All right, yeah, thank you. You're recording. You're recording, lady. Nice. Remember, the rest of the students, you should answer the questions in two, I mean, in four B, right? It says, which are you better at remembering, names or faces? Just answer the best one, okay? Circle the best one. It's about you. What is your bedroom like right now? Tidy or messy? If you ask me, it's messy right now. The next one, it says, what kind of video game do you prefer? Sport games or fantasy games? Well, it's going to be up to you. Thank you, thank you, Eric. Now that activity is gonna be for you because um, I wanna explain you how it's gonna be the way to send me the activities you already finished, okay? Thanks, thanks a lot. Camila, hello, are you there? Guys, just to let you know, don't uh, don't like um, don't avoid practicing English. Okay, if you have the chance to practice your English at home with your mother, with your father, with your sister, with your brother, with your dog, <laughs> with your whatever, practice your English, guys. Because if not, you're gonna forget it. It's like if you don't ride your bike in some years, believe it or not, you forget it. All right, so please do not. Do not forget to practice your English. It's very important, guys. All right? Very good. So now we have Camila's one. Your left or right brain? Have you ever wondered why some people 
are much more assisted than others but cannot make simple conclusions? Or why the most scientists can think in time? It all depends on which side of your brain you use more, the left or the right. The left and right brain controls language and reason. Left brain people are more logical and better at math. Yeah. The right side of the brain is associated by art and music. People who really, really on the right side of the brain are more imaginative and intuitive. Thank you. Thank you, Camila. Nice reading. Very good. Now, give me a second. Give me a second, Jimena. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to explain you how it's going to be the way to, to give me your, your jobs today. All right? Guys, believe it or not, the brain is like qualified. It's divided. Left, right. Okay? And depending on the, on the side of your brain you're using, it is the stuff you really like. Okay, it is like if you if you're using your left brain, you're going to this 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 this. this. It says in the reading, okay, it says uh, the left brain the left brain people are more logical and better at math. So if you're better at math, you're using more your left side of your brain. Yeah, and it says if you're using the right side of your brain, it's as associated with art and music. All right, so you really like more dancing, music, like to paint, all those things, all right? Well, guys, unfortunately, guess what? We just have three minutes to explain how it's going to be the way to send me the activities, all right? Pay attention. If you already finished, listen to me. Oh, my God, I love the page. Give me a second. If you already finished with all this information, I want you to pay attention to the stuff because I'm going to tell you how it's going to be the way to send me the information. Pay attention. The first thing, the first thing that I want you to send me is the picture of this page, all right? You're going to take a picture of the page 78, and then you're going to send it to me to the group of WhatsApp. That is the first picture. Don't send one, and then five minutes later, the other one. Send the three of them together in the same, in the same message, please. Don't send in a different message, please, all right? So the first picture this page 78 the second picture these words okay these words with the part of the body we can wear the the item okay the activity from the notebook is the second picture okay and the third picture the third picture is going to be this one this answer okay this exercise answered and I want you to do in the notebook this translation, okay? So, again, pay attention. The picture of the, the, picture of the page 78, the information from your notebook, yeah, the, the items with, with uh, body parts, we can, we can wear that item, the translation, which is the same in the notebook, and that's it, all right? So 78, 79, the picture, and the information from your notebook, all right? The information from your notebook is the, the words from the 78 with the translation, okay? That is all the activities you have to send. Three pictures, okay? 78, 79, and the information from your notebook, all right? Yeah? Do you have a question, guys? Do you have a question? You have 24 hours to send me these activities, all right? You have 24 hours to send me these activities, yeah? So, guys, if you have no questions, it's time to say goodbye. It was a pleasure to be your teacher. Just to let you know, um, the next time, the next class is going to be the last class for me, yeah? Everything to the group of WhatsApp, Emily, yes. Guys, the next class, which is the one from tomorrow, is the last one that I'm going to give you as formal, okay? I'm going to give you the last grammar topic tomorrow, yeah? And then with this class, we're going to finish. Remember that on Thursday, we don't have a class. And on Friday, I have something special for you because it's the last class, okay? Listen to me again. On Wednesday, I'm going to give you the last grammar topic, and it's the final class. 
on Thursday, we don't have a class. But on, on Friday, I'm going to give you something special, okay, for the class. It's a different activity. It's not going to count, all right? But it's something special for you, okay? Have a nice day. I'll see you. Take your classes. Remember, give me the extra mile this final lap, okay? Say hello to your relatives, and then see you later, alligator after wild crocodile. Bye-bye, guys. Take care and send me the activities. 24 hours for the activities. Goodbye.